Hello, beautiful people. It's that time again that we do chit chat and we get those who matter when it comes to sports development in Ghana to tell us what is up their sleeves. Today, we're doing basketball again, but this time on a different dimension. Today, I have in the house somebody who has refused to appear on screen <laughs> for years. We've been trying to pull him, he doesn't come. <laughs> but today, eh, meaning that so something can change. <laughs> I have no other person than <laughs> Yao Sechi in the house. Oh, hey. Theo. Theo, I don't think that's a very fair introduction. <laughs> you know, I, I think that it's, it's about the timing. <laughs> you know, the Bible says in his time, he okay. makes all things good. Amen. <laughs> so it's good to see you. Whoa. Man, and you brought me out so early. Wow. You've done well. Hey, You're okay. a big man, man. <laughs> That's yeah, big, today, today, yeah. today, hmm, I've been yearning to get this opportunity to really find out. Um, the last time you cooked another one, you served Ghanaians uh, with a beautiful dish. I'm not talking about delicious restaurant. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, talking, I'm talking about basketball. Yes. So we, we saw the Africa Basketball Festival. Yes, in 2019. Yes. And then out of the boom, then something could be something, yes. something, everything yes. went to the background. Yes. Then we hear it's you've started. Back. Yes. You've put everything together now. Yes. The meal is ready to yes. be served. Yes. <laughs> In fact, yes. <laughs> what is this whole thing about? Oh, my goodness. Listen, I, I have good goosebumps right now because um first of all, let me say good morning to our viewers and, and thanks for the opportunity. Um amongst the many things we've done in basketball, I think that this will be uh the most um the biggest and, and the most challenging. Why? Because, and, and you know our story when it comes to basketball promotion in this country. Um, when we started Aspire Ball on the 2nd of January 2007 with just about 20 schools. 10 years down the line, we're engaging over 200, 250 schools every year with about 24, 26 schools, 16 boys, either 8 or 10 girls playing in the finals. It became, it became the one program every young basketball enthusiast basketball player old students look forward to we 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 relish th those moments mm -hmm. i think it's great however after 10 15 years theo you naturally want to challenge yourself you want to do more because you feel that you've built the capacity to be able to do more than you have done mm -hmm. so what it means is that let's go beyond the shores of ghana what can we do as a young team, right sports, to export? Ghana exports cocoa. Mm. It exports gold. Mm. Can we export a sport brand? A program that will start from here, but will travel through the African continent. And that is where the idea of Africa basketball festival started. It is not your regular basketball events. We call it a lifestyle. It's a lifestyle because it has basketball merging with music and fashion. Remember that December has become, uh, Ghana has become one of the destinations, preferred destinations for holiday people in December. But look at all the programs in December. They are all music driven. You have an Afro nation, Afro Chella, Beam Nation, Samini is doing this. It's all music. What happened to the sporting fans, people who want a sporting element? There are millions of basketball fans who love fashion because basketball and fashion and music are siblings. So why don't you create a platform that will accommodate all three and give fans or patrons a, a memorable experience and so all these elements of considerations came together 2019 idea was cooked in 2018 but then we executed in 2019 starting with Accra all-star versus Tema all-star just to break the ground so what we're about to experience this year should have happened in 2020 mm. but just like you know COVID 2020 it didn't happen 2021 just when we're putting ourselves together they said omicron okay another variant of of covid so we have to shelve it but thank god the grounds are fertile 
for the execution of the second edition of the Africa Basketball Festival. Now, keep in mind the name of the program, Africa. So what naturally you're going to see <coughs> are African teams playing or teams from different countries playing. So the very maiden one, which is next week Friday at the Book on Boxing Arena from 5 p.m. till Mama calls, and Mama won't call <laughs> if I switch off your phone. So when Mama calls, you don't hear. You are going to have Ghana play Nigeria. And when it comes to Ghana and Nigeria, we know, even laughing, we can compete. <laughs> laughing self can be a competition. You understand? Sleeping, we can have competition. When it comes to Ghana and Nigeria, anything is competitive. So that's why you have Ghana Jolov. We need to be honest. When it comes to ratings and basketball, Nigeria is far ahead of Ghana. However, when you're playing on your home turf, the dynamics are different. We beat them in football this year. Mm. That right? one, that one is another thing. Uh, so already they lose one. Yes, and we don't have strikers, and we used <laughs> so that that thing, that 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 juju we used or whatever. You know, they, they told us they were having seven strikers. Some the guy with the wax. Yes. yes. Oh, 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 yeah, or whatever. The, he, he's amazing. Yes. He in the Italian Serie yes, yes, Magic. Yes. Yes. And then we were told that he he will perform. And then we put a certain Amati somewhere to distract to, him to, and then to stop him. Jiku. So even their penalty, it wasn't scored by a striker. It was a defender. Their captain was a defender. Oh really? Uh -huh. That scored the penalty for them to, to equalize the one one. But uh -huh. we use the I will go rule. Mm. Uh -huh. So you see, they, they still have this issue. That how come we manage to because Nigeria is still bigger than us. Exactly. They are you are more. Even <laughs> they are bigger. <laughs> but <there's, laughs> And again, I hear Dan Gute still is thinking. <laughs> I renovated your stadium for you, everything. And, and we bust people there. Yeah, and then at the end of the day, you couldn't score Ghana without strikers. Charlie. And, 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 and you, you caused us the World Cup, too. we didn't go. Ooh. Charlie, so you, you're bringing them here. Yeah, the ball. The ball. <laughs> but we don't mind. So we are going to have Ghana play Nigeria mm. in the African contest, the okay. African competition. Basketball is not played only in Africa. As a matter of fact, basketball is not African. So international countries or foreign countries that play basketball, whilst this is called the festival, and in December, there are a lot of diasporans who come here. We need to create Something. the platform mm. for an international competition within the African Basketball Contest uh, Festival. So you're going to have France and the U.S., also play a game. Oh, yes. So you have um, players. You, you should see their training games, and the French they are speaking is not a joke. The French alone can intimidate you. The language alone can intimidate you. So it, it's beautiful. Now keep in mind, this is not just a basketball event. It's a lifestyle event. So you have a fashion show in between the games. Oh, okay. So they are fashion brands. So. Beautiful Beneath okay. as an s -Legon. They sell sporting brands and undergarments. So the lady says, yeah, we sell tennis stuff. We sell golf things. We'll bring our ladies to come and model them. And so they sell sneakers. You're going to see, um, and they sell undergarments. So you're going to see like ladies in sneakers and lingerie. You know, just to show you that. Then that is the thing. It is yeah, beautiful. Yeah, that is it's the beautiful. Thing. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful, you know. So we're gonna have models, uh, modeling fashion show in between, between the games. So, so picture this: France versus USA. The mm. game ends. Floodlight goes off. There are spotlights in between. There's DJ and the dust to play music. People Ooh. are jamming, and then red Ooh. carpet is rolled Rrr. over, Rrr. over Rrr. the court. Okay, yeah, 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 and yeah. then you hear the announcement, ladies and gentlemen, it's now time. Let's get ready to rumble. From beautiful beneath. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful. It's beautiful. And, and so so that's what's gonna happen. And right after the fashion show, thank you, ladies. And that was beautiful beneath located at East Legon. You can do yada 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 yada. You ready to party? Yes. Add them, go get them. Ah, uh, you, you, you. Uh, yeah, mobile. Yeah, hey, mobile. That's why you want us to put up for our phone <laughs> Because your mother, your mother shouldn't call you. Because it's happening. Energy high. 
Kobirana. You know Kobirana? I do. Kobirana and his dancers. Okay. My goodness. Mm. The show that they come do for them. So we sit back and we say, we pray to God that things go the way they should go. Mm. Because that will be a very big statement. So right after that, there's a dance uh, 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 halftime. And we've got some cheerleaders. You should see them. Big Ghana cheerleaders. Oh, yeah. 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 They are called Flawless Dance Studio. You should check them out. Mm. Brutal. Mm. Brutal. So mm. they will come and do their things. Then Floodlight comes back. Then there's a game between Ghana and Nigeria. And in between. So, and there's a fashion show. Elikem the tailor bringing his, his, his people. We've got an uh, edgy woman in, 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 in uh, her places around um, Christian Village. We've got five fits. So in between the basketball game, music performances, and a fashion show. You can, it can get better than this, okay? Now keep in mind, just like you know you've been part of the Spyball story, when we started on the 2nd of January 2007, with just about 20 schools, there about 10 years down the line, we were engaging over 250 schools. So you don't have to be a prophet to know that if this year the Africa Basketball Festival has Ghana and Nigeria playing in the African uh, contest and France and, and, and the US playing in the international contest, you need to know that come next year, mm. if we are live, <clears throat> Ghana and it won't just be Ghana and Nigeria, Nigeria, but there the are the more countries coming, coming in. And there are more countries on the side. So you can have, and there will be more fashion houses from Nigeria and all the competing countries. So it can't just be a one-day event. Now this is going to grow into a real festival where you accommodate a lot more countries okay. playing wow. and it will be beautiful. Wow. So that's why I say to you, even before we see the realization of the bigger picture, we are super excited about it because this is something that becomes a Ghanaian product that will be exported. Why? Because come 2025, if not 2026, the Africa Basketball Festival should be held in Nigeria. Mm. So this time you hear Africa <coughs> Basketball Festival happening in Nigeria or Lagos, Nigeria. The next year, you should go hold it in South Africa. Mm. Because it's is Africa Basketball Festival. Mm. So all the countries, if the destination is South Africa, we all fly there. We are having a good time. And now suddenly, real big boys in terms of basketball would want to be, be representing yeah, 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 yeah. representing their well, countries. Well, that is where we're going. Well, well. So it, it's been a long time coming. But like I said, in his time, it makes Amazing. things beautiful. So that's what's going to happen. Come the 23rd. So we're talking next week, Friday. Next week. Okay. So all your answers there. So next week, Friday, let's look at this, this thing. It, it has been trending. If you see, don't be surprised. Just get involved. Bukum Boxing Arena. In, in fact, that place is big enough. You can come. You, security is there. Your yes. cars will be safe. So if Mama even calls, so mm -hmm. let's enjoy this and come back. <laughs> The, the, the other one doesn't want yes. to play, play but, 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 but you see, um, if you're on social media and you see these things, just get ready because it's not this Friday, uh, next week Friday. Next week Please Friday. Make sure that you tell somebody yes. and tell somebody. Yes. Bring along somebody. Yes. In fact, if mama will call and they need me, you, you send, send the children to grandma and then come. Yes, yes, yes. yes. <laughs> and when you're coming, bring your pen and your paper because for beautiful beneath, if you don't take it, 2023, you change your wardrobe. Yes, so, yes. <laughs> so that you write it down. <laughs> because of the time and everything. <laughs> then the rest now can please just jot them down. So that the, the, the socialization yes. networking It thing, is very important. It's very, very necessary. Very important. Uh, so at least. Yeah, so, so that's what is happening. And so we're going to. So people are asking, um, how do we get tickets? So okay. you, uh, I was coming there. It is, uh, this, this event, we want people like yourself. Mm -hmm. We want a certain some people be to come mm. so 
Book and Boxing Arena sitting capacity is almost 3,000, if not more. Already about 2,200 tickets have been allocated. Mm. What we want to do is that for those following our social media platforms, we want to be able to give out some ticket. We don't want to even sell. People want, we want to buy tickets. No, it's not about you. It's about some people we want because we have sponsors like Caveman Watches, you've got Coca-Cola, you've got Glyco, um, you have Ebony Condoms. We're giving because they also have their... So Glyco has a lot of uh, customers. So we're giving them to give their customers to come. Give people, when they come sit down, big boys, they're enjoying a show. You know, no giddy giddy. Mm. So it, it, it's, it's tough. If you ask me, okay, so can somebody buy a ticket today? I don't have an answer. What I do know is that Follow our social media pages, which is at Real ABF. Take your time. Real, you take your, Real ABF is Real as an R E A L. Uh -huh. ABF is Africa Basketball Festival. So Real ABF on either Instagram, Facebook, or Twitter. By Monday, we intend to roll out some mechanics. You know how you can get one if you want. The, 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 the key thing is they should follow. Just follow the pages, please. And I beg you, follow. Yes, please and follow. then you get. Way. Uh, you will be there. Maybe yeah, you yes. will watch and come and tell you. But if you want to come and see something, yeah, yeah, yeah. because I mean, the yeah. morning they do it. Yes, as the time runs fast, it's, it's always interesting. <laughs> okay, yeah. It is well with our souls. Okay. Beautiful Beneath, Edgy Woman, um, Elikem the Taylor, uh, Fine Fit, and as usual, we want to say a big thank you to Beyond the Return. So this one has Beyond the Return, you know, supporting us. The France Embassy, mm. amazing. You should see them. They are super excited about it. And like I mentioned, Caveman, uh, Bonnie Condoms, Glyco, uh, Coca-Cola, My Sprite People. Everybody is excited. And we want to do this together. So next week, Friday, from 5 p.m. to Mama Calls and turn off your phone. Bukum Box uh, Arena. Bukum Box the Arena is the place. Uh, come after work. Just drive there straight. Like you said, enough packing. Pack. And come and enjoy. A show. Oh, when in fact, in fact, take away all the stress from January to whatever exactly. it is. Exactly. And just come and get just ready come for and enjoy. 2023. Exactly. In fact, baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So this is how we draw the curtains here on the page. Uh, trust. Yeah, yeah, we'll come back here. Yes. <laughs> yes, 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 After yes. That, there are a lot of things he's doing behind the scenes. If you don't even take it, I can give you free ticket to to go to Delish. Yeah. And uh, but yeah. that one is not today. <laughs> <laughs> it's another package. Thank you very much for doing the watching. Remember, next week, uh, all roads will lead you to the Bugon Boxing Arena. Trust me, you just come. If you don't enjoy it, you can. We'll give you back your money. Exactly. On this note, we say thank you very much. Keep watching GBC News. Bye for now. <laughs>